You see, Rachel and Zach, you chose each other because you have been each other's best friend for seven years. Just like Jacob Abino, who loved Rachel and worked very hard for seven years to marry. So you can see the parallel between Rachel <laughs> and Zach. And yet, the Torah says that that love was so strong that it seemed in Yaakov's eyes as just a few days. So your connection to each other is so strong that even long distances did not impact on that bond. Behold, you are consecrated to me by this ring, according to the law of Moses and Israel. I am to my beloved. I am to my beloved. And my beloved is to me. And my beloved is to me. Go ahead. Go ahead. You know, when we raised our kids, we taught them that when you marry, two families marry too. It's not just two people. Could not imagine celebrating uh, my wedding, my marriage to Rachel without all of you here, so it means the world. Besides marrying each other, the most important thing was having so many people we loved in one room. And this is exactly that. So this is just the best moment. Thank you all so much for being here. Hi, everybody. For those who don't know me, I'm the no no. Baruch Ata Adonai, Elmenu Melech HaOlam, Hamotzi Lechem Min Aretz. When your kids are small, all you care about is keeping them safe and making them feel safe. And as they get older, um, you worry about whether you can teach them everything you want them to know, everything that you think they should learn. I don't worry anymore about trying to teach Rachel anything. She's teaching me. I'm learning from her. So these two, they're a great couple. Uh, they'll be learning from each other just as they have been all along. And uh, Zach, you now get the benefit of what I've been getting up till now. Lucky you. Zach and Rachel, today you stood before all of us in the presence of God, affirming your commitment to each other and to the Jewish life you will build together. We are so proud of both of you and we are excited for your future. When I asked Nanny what it took to raise a kid, she, our paternal grandmother, the sage of all sages said, if you love your child the way I love you, you have nothing to worry about. I'm not concerned for your marriage. Marriage has trials and tribulations, challenges. It comes with the territory. But you both come from warm and loving families. And if you nurture and further foster that one most essential ingredient, you'll be great. If you love each other the way we love you, you have nothing to worry about. L'chaim. Rachel, we have seen how happy Zachary is with you. We have watched over time how your love for each other has blossomed and how you bring out the best in each other. You are truly each other's Besherit. We know that together, you and Zach will build a beautiful Jewish home and community around yourselves. We wish you both a lifetime of happiness, good health, lots of loves, and many laughs together. Mazel tov, we love you! 
I know that in our marriage, it's only going to keep getting stronger. Today is just the one piece of the rest of our lives together. And I'm so, so lucky I get to spend it with you.